Hi, I'm Sean from Child Bite. Hi, I'm Sean from Child Bite. <laughs> We're on tour with uh, Super Joint and Battle Cross. Yes. We're just outside of Chicago right now. Yep. And we're gonna take you on a tour of Deep Red. Deep Red. This is uh, the driver's seat of Deep Red as well as the steering wheel. You know, Sean here does all the nighttime driving. Yeah. He's all hopped up on Mountain Dew until six in the morning. And then either Brandon or I, we wake up at seven in the morning and take it from there. Yeah, music changes. I, I probably have the most in the... I'm always looking, I'm always playing new and weirder shit, I think, more than the other guys. Yeah, he's kind of going all over the place. When I'm driving, it's pretty much just Danzig. Yeah. And then, or you know, if I want to mix it up, I'll put on some Sam Hain or some Misfits. And, uh, and then when Brandon's driving, it's either dead silence <laughs> or YouTube clips of weird teenage boys <laughs> writing songs and trying to become famous and apologizing for them during the videos. Yeah. Generally pretty awkward. Pretty pretty freaking awkward. <laughs> this thing, we don't have a name for it. We don't know what it is. We found it, we got trapped one time in a, well, we were in Texas and we, I don't know if we hit a portal or what it was, but we got trapped in the dark brownwood forest. I don't know if you've ever been there, but it's it's kind of like something like a Blair Witch Project kind of situation. Yeah. There's a YouTube video out there. You should if you do, If you do a YouTube search for dark brownwood forest, you find a movie, it's all about this thing and it's 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 actually you probably shouldn't watch it. It's really scary. Yeah, it's pretty scary. Yeah, this is what keeps uh, Brandon and Jeff pretty uh pretty regular. <laughs> they're really they're a lot. Some like the up front guys here, the two Shans do a lot of wipe smear, wipe smear, and they do a lot of the, the amount of musol keeps them so they don't even have to wipe. Yeah, they're like you know they they'll go into yeah they'll not even touch the toilet paper because they're like I don't need that anymore. I'm beyond it because of this. Uh, I don't know. This is, I bought this because I'm one of these days I want to dress up like Kevin Bonds from Super Joint and get up on stage. Um, tonight might be the night, I don't know. And uh, the, he always wears a red bandana, so eventually I'm going to throw this thing on. We also use it to wipe the window off if we have to. Yeah. Yeah, that's enough. <laughs> Look at that. All right. Yeah, we're done up here. All right, this is the center wing of Profondo Rosa, a.k.a. Deep Red. This is kind of the middle lounging bench area. Rob Chinchit loves hanging out here. <laughs> it's kind of his favorite spot to, you know, these, contemplate on life. These are our holes. Oh, yeah, let's follow here into the back. This is the more exciting part. The more exciting part is just staring at Sean's ass while he tries to clear out his bunk. We uh, decided that we wanted to save money uh, and we didn't want to sleep at hotels anymore, so we built these weird quadrants in the back of the van, which is essentially like a table. Uh, we didn't even hook, like screw it into the van, it's just like tightly built inside the van. Like you can't move it, you can't move yeah. it around. So, yeah, we just like got some foam put up dividers for some semblance of privacy and um, and then we just we hole out every night get get whole get in yeah. the hole you know? yeah after a show Sean will drive an hour or two in the direction of wherever we're going uh, just to you know cut into the next the next day's drive and we'll pull up to a uh, flying J or a loves or, or a TNA a, or TNA yeah. as he refers to them <laughs> uh, pilots even and uh, yeah we all crawl into our little uh, a little holes. Yeah. A, uh, and we become Bunky Brewster. Yeah. Yep. We're all little Bunky Brewsters. In our holes. In our holes. Sometimes Rob Chid shits on the inside. <laughs> <laughs> so these, I, I'm the only one who pimped out my bunk with like sexy lights for special me time. He likes to relive his 17 year old fantasies. Yeah. The Christmas lights, little reading light. Yeah. Rigged up this little air conditioning blaster. Yeah, that's for the summer. Yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll get, AC, I'll get into my hole. Because he's got an AC blaster down in there, but that's the only AC vent in this whole thing. So we shoot some of it up here. I didn't put any light. Well, we don't need lights because we actually yeah. have these built-in ones. 
I typically fall asleep the second I crawl in here anyways. It takes me forever to fall asleep, so I'll drive at night and then I'll stay up and watch Netflix until about five in the morning. But then I usually have to pee like three or four times, which is super annoying. Yeah. <laughs> so, cause I, yeah. I, I drink a full Doozler while on the road. So I don't, safety first, you know? Yeah. Do Doozler equals safety. <laughs> well, you know, I like the first time we toured with Super Joint or Down, I think, about a year and a half ago, I went on their bus one time and it was specifically just to check out their bunks. And I remember going up there and I measured, ah, shit. Oh, <laughs> measuring it with my hand, like, it was like, oh, fingertip to armpit is like the height and blah, 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 blah is the width. And so these are actually slightly bigger than the bunks that they have on the tour buses. And then I figured, hey, if it's good enough for and Salmo and the guys, then I'm sure we can make it work. The only difference being that they can just kind of roll into theirs from the side where we have to cr crawl in like a weird hedgehog or something. Yeah. They're, not, yeah, they're definitely honestly, not a normal hedgehog, like a weird hedgehog. Well, yeah, you don't look like a normal hedgehog. <laughs> People have compared them to coffins or like Japanese pods. Yeah, okay, well, even like a, it'd be like a morgue thing, you know? <laughs> that, this little drawer that you got there. But they're only a couple inches shy of a twin bed. Yeah. yeah. Only by like three inches. So. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Thank you for uh, checking out our van. This is This is it. It works for us, and uh, if you want any uh, info about us, videos, our latest record, anything like that, go to childbite.com, and you'll get it there. That's where it is. Right, Kate? Yeah. Yeah, Google that shit. Yeah, Google childbite.com. <laughs> Google Rob Chin shit, too. Yeah. Maybe not. Is there anything? <laughs> nah, don't, don't do that one. Just do childbite. <laughs>